I'm Faith Ray. Um, I'm a graphic design major here, and I worked on like vinyl records for my art show. I like graphically did them on Adobe Illustrator. My name is Clover Wagner. I am a graphic design major with a certificate in museum studies, and my whole senior show was about the Tanakh and Torah and different scenes from there, digitally illustrated on Adobe. Uh, Adobe Illustrator. My biggest inspiration, like each album has like a different like genre inspirational like type thing, but the main one was the Lumineers and like just that different type of genre. So like indie and then the other one was more pop and the other one was more like indie pop and just like taking the musical genres into account. I just wanted to show different aspects of God being a beacon of hope and light during dark times. My favorite one was the middle one, which is called The Homemade's um, Sleep in the Bed You Made, which covers like the issue behind like hoarding and like bad childhood and like family issues and like it just covers like all of that like detail of my life. Um, and I put it into like a musical album and like the songs on it correlate to like the topic and everything. My favorite is Wisdom at the Highest Point because it's at the very end of the Tanakh and so you go throughout all of this enlightening and learning and then at the end you're wiser and she's greeting you at the highest point. I did my own research and looking into the songs I like, um, the way that the artist and like the Lumineers, um, Hosier and all of these types of artists, how they have like their own album covers and I kind of like based it off of that and used their inspiration because you know each genre has like different kind of roles and everything so yeah. Christians have like a Bible, uh, they have the different versions of the Bible. Jewish people have the Torah which is the first five books and then the Tanakh which is like songs and prophets and all of that. My least favorite one was probably Midnight Dreams just because it was more of a, um, I went more into the pop genre and like I love the genre in itself but trying to figure out how to push it whenever I was really stuck in the indie phase was just like figuring out how to like graphically make it look different and just like that. Just having to flip the switch was hard. The hardest one to work on was the Valley of Bones because I had to like zoom in there and draw each skeleton and each bone by itself and that took days. Wouldn't recommend it. So yeah. If you want to like listen to the songs on the playlist, um, I do have a website, which at the show there's a QR code, um, and you can go listen to the playlist of all the songs that the album is based off of. I just want to say uh, that Aaron and David were amazing, and we wouldn't be here without them, and so I'm very thankful for them.